Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video of Forza Street. Brand new game out of Forza on mobile. What we are doing right at the moment is we're running through a tutorial on how to play the game. Uh, very, very simplistic uh, to say the least from what I've seen here at the moment. But I wanted to try this game in a different direction that I wanted to play, um, you know, mobile games. And I figured, you know what, I haven't played a car game on this channel. And I've never featured a car game on this channel, for, and I figured, why not? This game was in a registration period, and it was for a little while. I know this game has been out for a while in beta testing and things like that, so unfortunately I wasn't one of those lucky people to test it out initially and to play the game um, a lot more beforehand, but now we have it released globally, I believe, so I think everyone has the ability now to play the game. Um, I'm currently using Android for those that don't, are not aware that I've seen this game for the first time or seen any of my content for the first time. But I figured, why not? Let's check it out and see what it's all about. So we've got this girl here, Kiko. Um, all right, you've had your fun, bring my car pack. Why not? Let's hook you up with a new set of wheels for the finals. Sure, why not? So I think this is more or less a uh, tutorial of the game as we're playing it. So as you sort of play the game for the first time, it sort of uh, dives you right into it. You saw beforehand the little cutscene with the, the starting progression or how the game sort of came to be or what influenced um, you know the, the game personality of it I guess so at the at the same time. But anyway I digress. Let's have a look at some of the cars that we've got here. So we've got a Ford Mustang, cool. You can change your colours and whatnot which is awesome. We've got a BMW M3 91 model. Um, personally this is a favourite of mine. And what else we got here? We've got a Datsun Fair Lady Z, okay, 69 model. Let's go over to the Beamer. I am partial to the Beamer. White or red? I'm gonna pick white. A little bit boring, but I do enjoy the old M30, M3. So that's just my, one of my, one of my favorite classic cars. Next to some early model Porsches as well, so but anyway, that's just that's for another story. But I wanted to try the game anyway and have a crack at it. It's something completely different that I haven't played on my channel. So looking at a little bit of diversity as well. But also I want to see how you guys uh, take to the game as well. So for some of my more loyal subscribers, if you guys are interested in the game, well, here's some gameplay for you today. Anyone new that have reached the channel, welcome aboard. Um, hopefully you guys have a good time here. But do check out the rest of my content on my channel. I do focus on a lot of other genres as well, specifically survival. Um, but let's see how we go with Forza Street. So Elisa here, Alicia. What's up Miami, how are you all feeling tonight? So we got Lisa Hamilton here. He was Street TV at the Forza Street Finals. You know the deal, when it goes through, Lisa goes home. Well, straightforward, straight to the point. Okay, cool, so we've got a bit of a um, Bit of a rev meter here that we can muck about with, so I'm going to stay in the yellow zone for this like a decent sh uh, shift. Hold down the, I, I'd imagine the accelerator button, uh, button here, so as you can see here I've still got it held down. And once we sort of get to, whoop, I broke to late, but I got the perfect gas, which is fine. So we are in the mix here to try and defeat our rival here, I guess. Brake, good braking, back on the accelerator, on with, onwards we go, up and over, and it's very cinematic, the um, the gameplay itself, so as you can see, the cameras move, weave in and out, we've got our fella here, he's just blown past us, which is all fine, I'm right on his bumper here, let's hit the NOS, and let's go for gold here, finish this off, but this is still a tutorial guys, so I think you're just always destined to win this as it is, but once we sort of get into some actual um, racing, I would imagine that we can, um, you know, have other scenarios, we'll probably have to start doing some upgrades to, to our cars and things like that as you would in any sort of um, car game. Anyway, she didn't believe it, which is awesome, we blew past that new challenger, awesome, we're going through to the next part. Um, that Ford there, 
not a bad car either. I do like those. I think that's an RS200 if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure it is. Okay, I haven't seen driving like that in a while. Congrats on qualifying. Phones blowing up. Forza Street want to know who, what to call you. Anyway, what we've got here is some new rewards. Awesome tuning kits. And if you guys sign in, you guys will get a bonus 100 gold. I don't have an Xbox Live account, so I'm going to do maybe later. Um, so let's just miss out for now. Anyway, it is what it is. Okay, your official Forza Street registration is on its way. Alright, so it looks like we're getting another car. Uh, another car. Let's take this card. Cool, let's claim it. And this is a offer that just tends to pop up and I'm assuming that you can just navigate to find the type of car style that you'd like. Let's go into claim our new car. See what we get out of this. Let's go ahead and claim. It's a common one star car, so very basic I guess. Um, apparently we hold. Oh, okay. Oh, geez. I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay, so you can see there's Porsche, Nissan, BMW. Okay, I'm just going to release and whatever happens, happens. Um, what do I get? I've got a Porsche 944 Turbo. Okay, cool, cool. Not bad. I guess cool little starter cars to start up with. Very, very retro. 944 Turbo. These street, uh, these common cars are great, but how about I hook you up with a rare one? Okay. Yeah, I thought that might get your attention. I'll have it del delivered tomorrow. Just let me know what you're into. Yeah. All right. Well, how do I let you know what what uh, what car that I'll be into and what type of car that I can get my hands on? Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um. Okay. Muscle. And oh. I don't mind the Focus RS, I do enjoy my hot hatches, but, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go with the Beamer again, yeah, why not, let's just go ahead and confirm that, perfect, nice choice, consider it done, okay, cool, so, <laughs> It looks like that you get hooked up quite a bit while you're playing the game. I don't know if it's just because the game is fully released now, um, so everyone else can start playing it. Um, but uh, assuming that would be the case for everyone, I'm sure that that would be it. Alright, so cool transition cinematics happening here. Ultimate Street Racing Tournament. Nice. Okay, let's meet the um, patrons. Yeah, okay. We got Omar. Alright. We've got uh, Jamelia. And we got uh, Tiberus. 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 Madison. We've got a few people here. I don't know if we're going to be contending with these guys. Who knows? Cool. Thomas Street Racing Legend. Now, I'm not too sure what, if the gameplay is going to extend to what we've got at the moment, because it seems very, very simple. I'm guessing it's asking us to add our cars in. So I'm guessing we will just have to add our cars that we've got available. I guess that's all we've got. So I guess we can alternate and switch between cars depending on situations, I guess. Yeah. Cool. Okay, let's fire it up. Forza Street Tournament starts right starts right now. Okay, nice. So let's go continue to this race. Awesome. And I'm assuming that we're just going to beat these two guys here. So we've got difficulty bar here. So it's a little bit on in favour of the um, our our opponent here. Uh, we can click into stats, check out the profile here, and see what we are lacking in and what they're in favor of. So we've got speed as our only um, strength here. Everything else not so good. Don't think we can click on anywhere else here at this point in time, which is fine. Whoop. And then if you want to alternate your car and do the same thing, but you know what, I'm going to stick with the Beamer for this one. 
So let's see if we can take out the muscle car. Okay, so obviously you get your little um, tips and things like here in between your loading screens. So if you want to take a note of it for your first time, suggest that you guys do just that. Okay, so design district. Okay, heads up, let's go. Uh, TV, street TV is using fa uh, fancy cinematic cameras of broadcast the tournament. That's cool. Okay, it's just amateur hour. Yeah, sure, look who it is. One and another medicine. Okay, from the good side, both of them. Alright. Newcomer is coming up. Just keep the pedal down and watch those corners. You can beat it. Cool, sure we can. Okay, so we got good, perfect, over rev. Let's see if we try and get it in the perfect map. It's too much. Oh well, doesn't matter. I'm sure there'll be plenty of times for us to get uh, perfect shifts and all that sort of good stuff. Alright, let's release perfect break, perfect one. Look at that, and just by coming around the corner, we ended up taking, um, overtaking, sorry, I should say. Okay, boom, perfect break. Perfect gas, let's just hit the nice and go for gold here. Look at that, we've got a little bit of separation between us now, which is awesome. Boom. And boom, no, a little bit too early, doesn't matter. So it looks like I'm just going to hit the nice here, just in case they get too close and try to overtake. I don't think that will be a thing, but all good on that front. So obviously we, we've won this round here. Okay, you will regret that. Okay, sure thing. Cool. So we won that. Can we move on to here? Yes, we can. And we can just move on to here. So I guess if you just keep tapping to the next um, person that you need to actually race, I'm assuming that might be little, little other, these little notes that you pass here that might have something here um, for when you actually go into the actual tournaments here. So I'm guessing this is still getting out of your you know, tutorial stage. Okay, so a little bit more on the difficult side. He's got a nice Porsche. There we go. 95, 95, 911 GT2. I kind of like the um, the nine the nine six fours personally. Uh, that's just my personal taste. Uh, same era as well. The ninety models. So ninety five, I'd go. Um, personally, that's just something that you guys probably don't know about me, but I do like the older style Porsches. Um, probably not as um, overdone like this, but nice, respectable, clean. That's that's what I enjoy. And of course, it's going to be a stick shift. Okay, so this guy's the CEO. Awesome. He seems a little bit more humble. Okay, not sure to say anything definitive, but there could be trouble. Okay. Both hands on the wheel, things are just getting warmed up. Yeah, alright. Let's do it. Two German cars going at it today. Let's see if you can get a perfect shift. Look at that perfect launch. There we go. And immediately put yourself to, um, your foot on the pedal there. And as you're sort of driving down the road here, let's release. Perfect break. Get on the gas. There we go. And let's just use the boss because we're at full capacity. Look at that. Blasted our way through. Boom. Boom. And yeah, look. Looks like a very, very simple game. I'm sure there's going to be some very challenging times for us um, as we sort of progress on. Oh, a little bit early there, but that's okay. We've got a full nitrous bottle there, so let's just hit it. And easy as you like. Finished it off. Out of problem. Out of sight. You're not going to get any pain in me. So that's, I guess that's probably the only time that you, you're going to obviously win by default, I guess. Because it was fairly, fairly easy. It looks like there's a new competition here. We can sort of wiggle our way here through here. So we've got a few things that we can look forward to. Let's just drop both cars in. Let's start the tournament. Okay, consider me impressed. Cool word of advice. Get yourself a solid supercar. You need to stay competitive over the next few events. Cool. So let's play. Yeah, that's right. Kiko time. Okay, so we're playing the um, the intro girl. Awesome. And do we start? Yep. Yeah, okay, we're in. 
Maybe real quick, forgot to explain the event rewards. Cool, adjust your car's PI to check out the difficulty meter. More difficult, more advanced score, which means best with better rewards. Well, all right, don't let it stress you out. Just keep winning races and you'll get the hang of it. Well, let's just go hard because you can just tick these guys here. Why not? I may as well. And yeah, see what happens with that. But let me know if you guys are enjoying this. And if you guys want to see more, let me know in the comments. Hit the like button. Let me know that you guys are interested in uh, Forza Street there. Uh, something a little bit different. Car games. I do enjoy my car games. Um, haven't come across a really good one for a while now. Um, I did want to start other car games as well. Notably things like um, Magnificent Speed. Um, you know, uh, see someone if I'm mistaken. But those games have been out for quite a long time and there's, there's a lot of content out there, a lot of creatives out there, most importantly, have created a lot of videos on those games. So I felt like I didn't want to jump into that at that time. So with something like this, it's a completely different game. It's a new game as well. So I figured why not give it a crack. And if you guys enjoy it, well, look, I can continue playing it. Why not? Um, I think that might be something that you know we can make something out of. But if you don't enjoy it, let me know why that you didn't enjoy it. Is you know, is the gameplay at this point a little bit more on the easy side for a lot of people to, uh, for you guys to warrant to play the game? Um, I'm not too sure, but that's something that I'd love to hear from you guys as feedback for yourselves personally. If you don't like the game, it is what it is. If you guys enjoy the game, let me know what you guys, um, how you guys feel about the game. If you guys enjoy it yourselves, if you guys want me to continue playing it. And yeah, look, let me know how far you've gotten in the game so far if you guys are actively playing this game. Um, it'd be interesting to know where you guys are at. Um, I don't know whether or not they'll have like little like, little groups, crews, clans, whatever you want to call them. Um, you know, if that's something that might happen in the future there. Um, I guess that we could do something about that. Maybe we can formulate our own crew. Why not? That, that'd be something cool. Um, I wouldn't mind doing that personally myself. So. That, that would be something that we can sort of invest our time in. Now there's a bit of a fork in the road here. So we can either go one way or the other. I'm gonna go up this way. The other reason why is I get more money up this way or more points I guess up this way. Uh, might be head of the pack, but don't get so cocky. Cool. There are cars and race data from other players in the tournament. Full D, uh, Driviators, he's one now. Okay. Okay, here we go, dynamic races are available for when the car has at least 20 plus 20 advantage over the opponent's car. These In these challenging races, the PI scales up to match yours and you'll win. Okay, fair enough. And then obviously you check the stats here and see what sets you apart from your opponent there. And cool, alright, well, I'm just going to go for it, why not? I guess I'll just keep going hard until I don't win and then I can sort of knock it back a little bit and then find a comfortable balance um, that I can win. I guess in this sense here this is when you sort of go down the upgrade path to upgrading your vehicles which at this point in time we haven't really been introduced to that yet so I wonder if that happens after we get out of this, um, this tournament here. So what we'll try and do is we'll try and finish off this tournament here because we've only got this race and one more and hopefully we we'll I'll discover a few other bits and pieces, maybe, who knows. Here we go. Cool. Perfect, perfect. Look at that. So far, I've edged ahead, which is good. And over to the next corner over here. And back on. Look at that. Perfect, perfect. So far, so good. I wonder what happens if you get, like, a perfect race. Or perfect, you know, perfect everything. Not too sure. Oop, a little bit early. Oh, well, I fumbled that one. Anyway. Let's just hit the nitrous there and let's get out of sight. And I think that will do us nice and easy. A little bit of a launch off the ground there, which is awesome. So I've won that one nice and easy. So like I said, I think with this here, especially probably the first event that they just really rushed you into, which obviously makes you inclined to play the game or play this part without, you know, rather than sort of backing out, I guess that you, um, uh, gold is a valuable currency primarily used to purchasing cars, awesome, don't show that again, 
and I guess we go to the uh, to the final event. Well, I probably would imagine that you can go back into the event here, and I'd imagine that ooh, that's a little bit difficult there. But let's see how we go. Is a Nissan GDR after all, so we'll see if this is way out of our element here. But we'll, we'll give it a crack on. But yeah, um, I'm guessing that you might be able to revisit some of these events and finish some of those areas to maybe get 100% completion, if that's a thing, um, which I'm guessing that it could be, but we'll see. Uh, I think you can just walk in disrespect Mr. Bosch. Okay, cool. No worries, buddy. Let's see if we can win our way through the final event here. Another perfect launch. Look at that. And let's hit it. Okay, we are coming up on the side on this fella here. Let's get that perfect... No, we missed out on that. But we got perfect gas. And let's hit the nice there. And let's just try and stay ahead. Perfect break. That. Back on it. Great. That's alright. Not too bad. So we are pushing our way through. And hopefully we can stay ahead. Okay. Boom. Great. And back on great, and we've got the full loss there. I think we should do this. It shouldn't be a problem for us here. Look at that. Boom. Done. So that is that. Alright, and it, and it tells you, of course, how you've, how you've done everything here throughout the course. So, perfect launch. Okay, corner. Good corner. Good corner. Finish. You guys would have probably seen that through the gameplay. I just didn't really share that up until now, but that's all well and good. Which we learned on Tribe like that. This is your show now, see you around. Cool, thanks buddy. Um, Alright, so it looks like we've finished that off. Victory rewards. I think everyone would probably go through this, you know, relatively unscathed. Well, you're already two events in past work, how about another shiny new car? Well, you just treat yourself, take this gold. They're really <laughs> throwing stuff at you. This is ridiculous. Your premium card awaits. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and claim our new car, I guess. Uh, okay. Purchase a premium card. Okay. So we tap that. Okay. As you can see here, there's a few cars here. I have no idea, the Ford R, uh, yeah, so it was an RS200, I was right, okay, cool. Well, I hope I get that for a car, I don't know. But you've got Chev, you've got Focus, uh, Mercedes, Ford, Chevelle, Nissan, okay. Well, let's go for it and see what we get from it, and boom. What do we get out of this? I've got a Corvette CR1, oh, ZR1, sorry. So classic muscle car there. So there might be um, orientated events for certain uh, car types as well. So you might have muscle, street, exotic, whatever. So that could be something as well. Completing level two. Cool. Okay. All right. I want to make these bad boys even faster? Well, yeah. Grab some tuning kits and I'll show you how it's done. There we go. So we're going to do our little tuning tutorial now. Uh, get your card. So let's claim him. There we go. So stage three, more credits, awesome. We can use that to improve the performance index of your cars. The higher the PI, the faster they go. There you go. Uh, here are a couple more tuning kits to get the party started. Nice. There you go. Let's go tune our cars. Choose any one of your cars that you wish to tune. Well. Do I have access to this fella here? I don't think I do. So I won't deal with you just yet. Yep, cool, cool, cool. Well, I like my M3 so much, so let's um, add these tuning kits in. Add this kit to increase your tuning level. Notice the bar increases, press here to remove it again. And alternatively, press here to auto-tune. Okay. So you can just drop all the kits in and then I, I'd assume that you just go tune car. Done. And my guy here has just been leveled up. So we can go back. I don't know what this button does here. It doesn't do anything. So 
Let's head back. I made some calls, lined up these daily rewards and challenges for you. Cool. You'll get all sorts of stuff just for showing up and winning races. Check them out. Let's go to our daily logins. Boom. Cool. And check out today's challenges. Cool. So if you do some of these here, you would obviously get further rewards. Continue the story. Okay. Plan to participate in the next events. Street TV will pull up in new numbers, but you should be careful. Anyway, thought I'd stop by and give you a heads up. See you in the third event. Well, that's it. So we're up to event three here. I think this will probably be a good time to go ahead and leave it today as an intro to the game. So let me know, guys, what you thought about this down in the comment section. Um, are you guys currently playing the game? Are you guys enjoying it, for that matter? If you guys aren't, let me know why. And if you guys would like me to continue playing this game, drop it that in the comments and let me know. Anyway, appreciate you guys stopping by, as always, for checking out this video today. So hit the like button, do me that favor there, comment down below, of course. And if you guys are new to the channel, if you enjoyed what you've seen here today, do consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway, guys, I'm out of here, and as always, I will catch you next time.